for reasons that only God knows, I took Russian in college. I took Russian and Arabic, I guess because I wanted to know what the others thought a lot. So I took Russian and Arabic. And I, uh, so uh, I, since I also had studied Hebrew, I, knew, I learned, I love languages. And so the Israeli government sent me, when I was 20 years old, sent me into the Soviet Union to smuggle in uh, Jewish items and smuggle out Jewish names. So it's fairly dangerous. And I was sent for a month because of my knowledge of Russian and Hebrew. I got a lot of information out, and a lot of names out. And uh, it, uh, it, it, it was a life-changing thing to see this happening. And obviously life-changing for me, even professionally, because as soon as I came home, I started lecturing. That's the reason I lectured at 21. And now, back from the Soviet Union as an American young man, I mean, how many kids went to the Soviet Union at 21? and had interesting stories to tell. So that's how I began my They called him James list. Bondberg. Yes. <laughs> Agent <is> Buck 29. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. And I, I will I end. like my Manischewitz shaken, <laughs> not stirred. You know what? That can't be topped. Thank you all very, Thank very you. much.